and his friend Andrew Saunders helping. So um, this game right now is running at 19 by 10. All the settings are turned up. It's getting 60 frames a second, and MSAA is turned on. It's all the way up in the game. What you'll notice as he's panning is if you look at the grass in the distance, you can see the scintillation, right? The grass is sort of not looking very solid. It's popping in and out. The tips of the grass especially are kind of popping in and out. Now, let's go look at the saucer's cabin. If you kind of walk up that path, just get the feel for what it looks like as you're walking through this environment. There's textures that are strobing. There's lights and there's darks. It's just not that perfect. And of course, we're all about making it better. Now give me a slow pan, Sean. And before we pan though, just watch the grass wave a little bit. Or right? kind of soak it in. And what I'm really talking about is, like up here, you see how the grass is not continuous, right? There's, it's not solid lines. And it's always been bugging me. I mean, I'm looking at this, and this game is maxed out. The game is running as fast as it can. All the quality settings are up. And this is a 19 by 10 monitor, and you look at this, and it does not look great. Right? It's a little bit disappointing. How many people would agree with me that that grass is not great grass? Are you with me? Okay, you're with me. Excellent. So what I would like now, Sean, is to show how we turn DSR on. So let's go to the game. You go to the settings. You turn it to 38 by 21. Right? 38 by 44K. Let's go back to the game. Right away, we haven't changed any settings in the, in the sort of the display. There's no like funky stuff going on. And all of a sudden, the textures on the grass are solid. Right? So what DSR does is it allows the game to render at a 4K resolution, and then we're using a sophisticated filter to resample that back down to the native resolution of the screen, which is display. And as you pan, you'll notice up here the textures are no longer scintillating, right? There's none of that, you know, in, out, is it straight, is it not straight? It's actually a much, much more immersive experience, right? That's because we're doing a higher resolution sampling of the textures, and then a filter to bring it back down to the 19 by 10. Now what I'd like to do to make it very, very clear is show you a side-by-side. -side. So I have another PC over here. Can we bring that up and swipe it halfway? So both games are configured exactly the same. The only difference is on the left-hand side, uh, it is running only at 19 by 10. And you can see again the grass is doing its little pop and scintillation. Let's just scroll around a little bit more and, and stay still for a second there. Kind of center it again and just stay still. Um, what I want you to focus on is there's something not right about the way the textures, which are those grasses, are being sampled. And it's not being fixed by AA. Now, Sean, on the right-hand side, give you the same pan. Look at the grass and look at the textures. You, you can really feel that those, you know, that's going to sting if you walk through it. It's going to like make your luggage. And this stuff, it's just like magic. It's not real. It doesn't look realistic at all. That is the essence of DSR, dynamic super resolution.